What's up, everybody? This is Eric the Tech Preacher. So I made a video about the new feature on the Galaxy S21 that's exclusive to the Galaxy S21. And it's uh, Samsung DeX connected it to a PC wirelessly. In that video, I showed you guys that you now have a new option in the Samsung DeX tab that you can connect wirelessly to a PC. Now, when I made that video, a few of you guys hit me in the comments and said, hey, you could do this with the Galaxy Note 20. So technically you can't, but technically you can. It's a workaround. Shout out to my man, uh, Will H Tech Review. He hit me up and said, hey, it's a PC workaround on how to make it work for almost any Samsung devices, any previous Samsung devices that have DeX. Well, in this video, I'm gonna show you how you could do the workaround Samsung DeX wirelessly on a PC using any Samsung device. Sit back and relax and get your popcorn ready and follow me on this journey. Let's go. What's up guys, this is Eric back with another video. So Samsung dropped a new feature on the Galaxy S21 uh, series of devices, uh, which you can wirelessly DeX your device to a PC. So in the drop down menu, uh, under your DeX settings, you do have a new toggle uh, that's called DeX to PC. Now you do have another toggle that says DeX to TV or monitor. You can connect your device via wirelessly to a compatible monitor that have Miracast or stream beam connected to a monitor or a TV that has Miracast. You can connect wirelessly with your Samsung device to a TV or monitor. Well, there's a new feature that's exclusively to the Galaxy S21 series of devices. It's called Dex to PC. Now with Dex to PC, what that does is if you have the Dex software installed on your PC, it will search your PC and it will find the DeX software that's on your PC and it will toggle on. So here, I have my PC right here. I got my Bluetooth keyboard and mouse right here. It found my PC wirelessly. Okay, so let's go on and get the Galaxy Note right here, the Galaxy Note 20, where you go to the drop down shade and you go to DeX. Uh, you do not have that option. So you do not have that option on the Galaxy Note 20 or any Galaxy devices besides the Galaxy S21. So here it is, you don't have that option, but it's a workaround. Now it's not that great. It doesn't work that great, but it is a workaround. Let me show you. So when you go to your computer, it's a few things that you have to do. Uh, let's go on and go to the computer. All right, so I have my computer booted up. Uh, a few things that you have to do here uh, to get this to work. <clears throat> First of all, you have to go to your settings. All right, when you go to the settings, you have to go to what's called system. All right, in system, you have what's called projecting to this PC. Uh, if you do not have this toggle, you have to enable it or download it. Uh, to do that, you have to go to apps and features right? And you have to go to uh, optional features and you have to find it uh, here. You have to add a feature or you have to scroll down here in your install features or you have to add a feature, right? When you add a feature, you have to go to uh, projecting to, to, T, to this PC. Uh, do you have to install it? All right. So I have that already installed on my PC. So when I open it up, now it's another thing you have to install. So you have to actually make sure you have two things installed on your PC to make this work. First, you have to have what's called projecting to this PC. Then you have to have your wireless display installed on your PC. Not all PCs have this installed. Some PCs you have to manually install this. All right, so right now I got projecting the PC already installed on my PC. But right here, it's not working. At the top right, it said, add wireless display. So I got to go back to my uh, options features. I have to add a feature. 
I have to scroll down until I find wireless display. I have to install it. All right, so two things you got to do here. You have to make sure projecting the, the PC is installed on your, on your computer and wireless display has to be installed on your computer in order for this to work. This is the workaround uh, to get almost any Samsung device to work. Now, there's some caveats involved in this and I'm gonna show you guys in a minute. So I'm going out and I'm gonna click back, go back to settings, go to my system and go to projecting to this PC and right here, uh, now I can project my Galaxy Note to the PC. Now, right here, uh, it may be toggled always off, which is recommended. So when you first uh, open up projecting to this PC, it will be off. You have to turn it on. All right, so at this point, I'm done here. I go to my Galaxy Note and I go to Dex. All right, and there it goes. So right there, it just found my Galaxy Note, right there, my PC, and I'm gonna start. So going back to the PC, you have to give it permission right there. So it's gonna ask you, uh, the Galaxy S20 uh, Ultra is attempted to project, and you hit yes. Well, okay. And so at this point, what it's doing is opening up the deck software. Okay, so now I have my Galaxy Note 20 connected to my PC via wirelessly using Samsung DeX. Okay, now it's not all peaches and cream here. You cannot use your computer mouse uh, while connected this way. All right, so right now my mouse doesn't work. The keyboard works, but the mouse doesn't work. Now, it don't matter if you have a uh, laptop or a desktop, your mouse will not work. That's one thing. Um, the second thing is that if you're gonna use uh, this portion of DeX, you have to connect a um, Bluetooth mouse if you wanna use mouse. If not, then you can use the device, which you can use the, the, the click pad to navigate. So you can use the phone itself to navigate, all right? Uh, or you can, again, you can use a mouse. So, so for this purposes, I connected a Bluetooth mouse to my device so I could show you guys some things. And the reason why is because it's so bad that you definitely have to have a external mouse in order to navigate. It's very jittery. Uh, the position is not that great. Um, and the lagginess and the latency is really bad. Uh, so you have to have a lot of patience doing it this way. So right now, uh, let me show you guys if I could get to the menu here right on the side. God, it's, it's really bad. So I call this pretty much unusable. Uh, and so I'm going to, I'm trying to go to the search right here and uh, okay. So I just want to show you guys at the keyboard. And I mean, it is very laggy, guys. So look at that. Wow. So I typed testing and it took at least two to three seconds for it to register uh, on the, the system. So you have a huge delay when typing. Also, the mouse, it don't matter if you use a device or external mouse, is definitely really bad. This is not a very good experience. This is not what DeX is for. The, the answer to the question is, is it is Samsung DeX wireless DeX exclusively to the Galaxy S21? Yes. Can you make it work on previous devices? Yes. You won't, it's like night and day when it comes down to the experience. You would not get a good experience uh, using this secondary method versus the Samsung official method. So hopefully Samsung will trickle down the Galaxy S21 software, the DeX software to PC down to previous devices. But as of right now, as of me recording this video, you can do it with this workaround, but the experience is not that great. 
This is Eric the Tech Preacher from Easy Computer Solutions. Leave your comments down below. Let me know what you think about wireless deck to PC in all its glory. See you guys on the next video. Peace.